It's time for Wiggle Worms. Time for Wiggle Worms. Yeah, it's time to get those jiggles out. Time to laugh those giggles out. With today's new book, it's Wiggle Worms. Hello, friends, and welcome to Wiggle Worms. My name is Franny, and I'm going to share a very fun story with you today. It's called Bark George by Jules Pfeiffer. The reason that this book is one of my favorites is that we get to make a lot of fun animal sounds with this story, so I can't wait to share it with you. But first, we are going to do a little clapping. Are you ready? Clap, clap, clap your hands, clap your hands together. Clap, clap, clap your hands, clap your hands together. Clap them up high, right to the sky. Clap them down low, right to your toes. Clap, clap, clap your hands, clap your hands together. Clap them very softly and clap them very loudly. Clap them very slowly and clap them very quickly. Clap, clap, clap your hands, clap your hands together. Clap, clap, clap your hands, clap your hands together. That was some excellent clapping. Bark George by Jules Pfeiffer. George's mother said, Bark George. George went, Meow. No, George, said George's mother. Cats go, Meow. Dogs go, Arf. Now, bark, George. George went, Quack, quack. No, George, said George's mother. Ducks go, quack, quack. Dogs go, arf. Now, bark, George. George went, oink. No, George, said George's mother. Pigs go, oink. Dogs go, arf. Now, bark, George. George went, moo. George's mother took George to the vet. I'll soon get to the bottom of this, said the vet. Please bark, George. George went, meow. The vet reached deep down inside of George and pulled out, what do you think it is? A cat. Bark again, George. George went, quack, quack. The vet reached deep, deep down inside of George and pulled out a duck. Bark again, George. George went, oink. The vet reached deep, deep, deep down inside of George and pulled out a pig. Bark again, George. George went, moo. The vet put on his longest latex glove. Then he reached deep, 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 deep down inside of George and pulled out a cow. Bark again, George. George went, arf! George's mother was so thrilled that she kissed the vet and the cat and the duck and the pig and the cow. On the way home, she wanted to show George off to everyone on the street. So she said, bark, George. And George went, hello. Oh, no. The end. Wasn't that a great story? I hope you loved Bark George as much as I did. All right, we've reached the end of our story time, but we do have time for one more quick song. So can you put your hands up here with me? Open them, shut them, open them, shut them. Give a little clap, clap, clap. Open them, shut them, open them, shut them. Put them in your lap, lap, lap. 
Wave them, wave them, wave them, wave them High up in the sky, sky, sky Wave to me, I'll wave to you Let's all say bye-bye Thanks for being a great audience and I'll see you soon It's time for Wiggle Worms Time for Wiggle Worms Yeah, it's time to get those jiggles out Time to laugh those giggles out With today's new book, it's Wiggle Worms Thanks for watching The Wiggle Worms If you like what you see, click on subscribe and you can see more story times just like this if you want to visit us in person, stop by the Bookworm of Edwards in the Vale Valley of Colorado and you can pick up any of the stories you see on our channel. We also do a story time at 9.15 every Monday morning and I'd love to see your smiling faces. If you don't happen to be in Colorado, you can still visit us online at bookwormofedwards.com and we'll ship any of these books right to your door. Have a great day!